Um, so what we really want is a passion because you know they might come from a previous industry they might come from directly from an undergraduate course um, but I think we need to know that they're engaged in the subject so that they know where they're going and why they want to do that course um, because we are you know quite vocationally based but I think I think passionate passion and engagement in the subject is what we're really looking for um, you know we're looking for a good two one but um, lots of people have that I think it's about looking for the other thing as well yeah, so we have um, a brand new media centre, uh, it's a year old, um, which was built with the courses that we have in mind, so that our students can work in a kind of simulated real world environment. So for example, our journalists will, are working in a newsroom, they have their own radio station and their own TV station, so that when we do practical exercises, um, we get them to work for a week, I mean they are assessed for a week doing a multi-platform journalism exercise. They have to run a newsroom which is online print, radio and television and clearly you need the real thing to do that. On our postgraduate journalism course we have a variety of uh, staff who come from a spectrum across the industry. So we have specialist broadcast journalists, a print journalist, online journalist um, and they all teach kind of sections of that um, and they've worked at you know the Scotsman, Scottish Television, the BBC, ITV. I myself teach on the course. I've got 20 years experience in ITV. Um, so, and then we also use a lot of part-time hourly paid staff who are industry practitioners themselves because as much as um, you know, we've got experience, you know, some of us have been in higher education, in my case, for seven years and you, know, you can kind of, it's difficult to keep up with the cutting edge so we bring contacts back in on a regular basis. Um, I mean, Jill Douglas, who did a lot of the um, sports coverage for the Olympics, lives locally. We're very lucky. She'll come in and teach our sports journalists 